This video is going to demonstrate how you can access your TI-84 graphing calculator emulator on your laptop. So the first thing you're going to want to do is if you can find your hard drive, if it is on your desktop, you're going to want to double click it and open up so that you see your applications folder. There's going to be several other folders there, but we are going to be concerned with that applications folder. You're going to then double click that. All right, and when you open that up, all of the various applications that is on your laptop will be there. You are going to scroll up and down and hunt for a folder that is entitled TI-84 Calculator. Okay, if you do not have that folder in your applications folder, then you are going to need to see uh, tech support in room 135. All right, now for those students who do not have the hard drive showing on their desktop, all right, you can come down here to your bar across the bottom and you can click on Finder. When you click on Finder, that too will open up your hard drive. And again, you see all those same folders with the application folder right there. So you're opening up that application folder and you're hunting for a folder inside there called TI-84 Calculator. All right, and again, if you do not find that folder, then you will need to take your laptop to tech support in room 135 so that they can make sure that that gets installed. All right, you're going to double click that folder. When you double click that, you are gonna find two files. One will be the emulator itself. The other will be the ROM image. You are going to double click the application, which is the one that looks like the calculator. When you do that, it's going to look like nothing is happening. However, up here in the top left-hand corner, it now says Wabbit Emu, all right, standing for Wabbit Emulator. All right, that's the name of the application. So it is running. You are then going to need to click on File and go to Open. Now, everyone's computer will probably open to a different location. All right, this one opened to the desktop. Okay, which I have nothing on my desktop. So you're going to again need to navigate to that applications folder. All right, you get there a variety of ways. If you have things showing up here in the left hand column, you could maybe have applications right there. If not, maybe the hard drive is right there. You could go the long way. You could also pull this drop down menu. All right, and go via the hard drive to there's the applications. All right, either way, or just clicking applications over here is going to get you straight to that application folder. Regardless of how you get there, you need to get back to that. Scroll until you find the folder that is entitled TI-84 Calculator. Click on it, open it, so that you are back to where those two files are. Okay, at this point, you are needing to select the ROM image. That is the one with the white icon. So when you select that and then hit open, then your TI-84 graphing calculator is going to be working. And we, you can move it anywhere around. It is just an application. It is going to work just like a regular TI-84 would. So you can do basic computations with it. Okay, just like you would. You can clear things out. You can graph linear equations. Anything that you could do with a regular TI-84, you are going to also be able to do with this emulator. Okay. Now... Um, you're not going to necessarily want to have to dig around in the hard drive, opening up the applications folder, finding that folder every time to get this up and running. All right, so I'm going to quit the application, which you will probably do. All right, this window was still open from where I found it in the applications folder. If you want to create a shortcut so that you can get to it much quicker, you're going to take that ROM image pull it out to your desktop and what that's going to do is that's going to create a shortcut to it. You could probably also pull it down and put it down in your bar down at the bottom if you would want to do that. All right, once I do that, okay, let's close out of this folder. All right, now one click, double click rather, all right, will automatically open up that calculator. All right, it's going to be a lot quicker than trying to dig around in that hard drive every time to find it. So just a few quick, easy steps to show you how to get to your TI-84 graphing calculator that you will be using um, in your various math classes and science classes and things of that nature. Um, your individual math teachers will be going through different tutorials to show you how to use all of the buttons as we introduce you to this calculator. Definitely thanks for watching. Don't forget to share with your friends and subscribe to the channel. Thanks.